hey guys welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing silk press on 4c hair using the chateau flat iron going from 4c to these beautiful bouncy curls stay tuned so started off with clarifying shampoo then a moisturizing shampoo i also gave her a deep conditioner we went straight into the blow drying i used a leave-in conditioner heat protectant before i started the blow drying process so now I'm going to the, the process. I'm going from the ends to the roots. I didn't physically put the hair in subsections, but if you could see, I'm taking her hair in small sections and blow drying it. I've been doing this for so long, I didn't really have to part it out, subsection it, but if you're new to this, that's exactly what I do recommend you do. But if you realize I'm only taking really small sections, and blow drying it at a time. I'm not blow drying the entire head at the same time. I'm taking small sections, I'm going from the tips, and then I'm working my way to the roots. So after the blow drying process, I went ahead and I added some vitamin E oil, like a dime size, very little, because I do not want the hair to be heavy and um, to be weighed down. And I also went back in with the blow dryer to spread the heat, spread the um, vitamin E oil evenly using the heat. Now I'm going in with the Chateau flat iron to two inches to finish this look. I don't need one or two passes because I made sure that her hair was properly washed and properly blow dried. So the secret now is to make the iron do the work for you. That's pretty much it. So go ahead, have fun watching, and then stay to the end to watch how I made these beautiful curls using the flat irons. Her hairline was really short, so I went in with the straightening comb to make sure that I was able to grab those little pieces.
Okay, go ahead, check out that pure silk. So we're gonna go in and we're gonna trim her hair. The first thing she asked is that she do not want a lot of hair taken off. She wants to maintain her length, so that's exactly what I did. I went in, I trimmed the, the split ends, and I kept her length as requested. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with the one inch flat irons. I straightened with the two inch, but I'm gonna go in with the one inch to curl her because I want the curls a little bit more tighter. So that's the size that I choose to switch out to. And you could also get the same one inch flat iron from shinysnaturalbeauty.com. I will also be dropping the link in the description bar below. To create these curls you can see i started at the roots i started curling exactly at the roots so it would be a little bit tighter i use my fingers to define the curl there you go Check out how beautiful these cars are. They are nice, they are tight, lovely. This was so soothing and satisfying. The curls bounced, they flowed.
think that the hair is nice it's healthy it has its own sheen it's just doing exactly what it's supposed to do it came out absolutely beautiful and if you have not yet subscribed don't forget to like subscribe and share this video with your friends your family whoever you think this may help and if i had it some value don't forget to leave a thumbs up and this is the final results she absolutely loved it loved it i did call her a week and a half or so later and ask her and this was what she sent me a week and a half this is where her curls were she still had some curls she was wrapping it herself and doing whatever but she maintained and this is a week after look how pretty she is she is so pretty she's so dope beautiful smile and i love it so yeah like subscribe and share this video thank you until next time guys sleep pretty